guys how are you doing today i hope you're all doing well and keeping safe my name is stella simon and i'm a registered clinical nutritionist first i'd like to welcome you all to my youtube channel thank you for the love thank you for the support and in case you're watching my video for the very first time please go ahead and subscribe in today's video i'll be sharing with you about the effects of alcohol on nutrition and health status I'm sure most of you have heard about the term alcohol before. Please let me know on the comment section. Do you think alcohol is a drug? Is it a toxin or is it a nutrient? Alcohol is a component which is found in alcoholic beverages, for example, the beers, the wines, and the spirit. The chemical name for alcohol is ethanol. And starting from how it affects nutrition, one, it suppresses appetite, which will lead to inadequate food intake. And it also displaces food from the diet. Another effect is that there is excessive excretion of nutrients through urine production. It also affects digestion and absorption. For the digestion part, what happens, we all have an organ which is called the pancreas and it's responsible for the production of digestive enzymes which aid in the process of digestion so what happens for an alcoholic person the pancreas function declines and there's production of little amount of the enzymes then for the absorption what happens is that when you drink alcohol it irritates the the gut wall and it can also lead to ulceration, what we call ulcers. And this means that the, the nutrients which would have been absorbed within the intestinal mucosa, they are not going to be absorbed optimally. Then it also affects the unborn baby. And this one is for the pregnant women. I'd like you to know that alcohol causes what we call the fetal alcohol syndrome. And in this syndrome, the baby is born with one brain damage and the baby also has facial features deformities, for example, the, the eyes and, and the lips. And so in case you're watching this video and you're pregnant and you're looking forward to giving birth to a healthy baby, please, please stay away from alcohol within the nine months of pregnancy. And another thing, alcohol has another effect on on the brain it causes brain damage and how this happens is that it causes the death of cells especially the white and and gray brain cells and another effect is that it also causes what we call ataxia where you find that there is poor coordination and there's it's like someone has no control because they don't have balance and it also affects a part of the brain which we call the cerebellum and this is the reason why you will find an alcoholic person most of the time they stagger when they are drunk and then another effect that it has on the brain is that it induces the the action of what we call the y aminobutyric acid and when this happens you'll find that it leads to memory impairment and this is the reason why you will find a, a, a drunk person when they tell you something then they don't remember the next day because they kind of black out and another thing is that it affects another part of the brain which we call the frontal lobe and when this part of the brain is affected there's poor judgment and there's also lack of emotional control another effect that alcohol has is that it affects an organ which we call the liver it causes the alcoholic liver disease it also affects the kidneys so so in case you want to to live a healthy life and you want your kidneys to stay healthy you really have to 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 stop consuming a lot of alcohol and if you can stop completely the better for you another organ which is affected is the heart you find that what alcohol does, it leads to increased heart rate. And this is very common, especially due to, due to long-term use of alcohol. Another organ which is affected is the pancreas. And when the pancreas is, is damaged, 
it is what we call pancreatitis so in case you are you want your pancreas to to stay healthy please do not consume alcohol then another thing that alcohol causes is dehydration and i'd like to say that if you are watching this video and you are addicted to alcohol please ensure you take another uh, a lot of water and i would also like you to seek medical attention there are so many rehabs and i always say that it's a decision first which you have to make you make a decision and you decide you know what i'm not going to take alcohol anymore and i need help at this point because at the rehabs once one you'll find that there's medical treatment there's the medical therapy part of it and again they'll add you to the support groups where you will you are able to start your journey to recovery then last but not least i'd like to encourage you whenever you take alcohol please do not drink and drive so that you can protect your life and you can save the lives of the other road users so those are the effects of alcohol on on our nutrition status and on our health status thank you so much for watching this video and in case you find this video useful please give it a thumbs up thank you so much for watching